You know, I was very lucky, as was the Goodman, to meet August very early in his career. He was an extraordinarily interesting human being, very, very warm, very concerned with the world. And of course, he was an extraordinary artist, and I think one of America's greatest playwrights. But he was also, um, you know, a good friend to the theater and, and to me personally. I would say that August Wilson was a self-made Person. He's a self-made man, a self-made artist. He was a person who didn't have a high school diploma, and he spent his days in the library and, and taught himself. And there's a generation of African Americans who were very much self-taught. It's a huge gift he's left us, and it's very poignant and poetic that once he finished radio golf, he was done. You know? Like, what else was he supposed to do? He came here as a gift, and he gave us the gift, and then he went on. You get a sense of what each decade was like for black people or people of color in this country. You know, and I don't know where else you're gonna get that. I mean, Ken Burns does a pretty good job, but August nails it. It has a rhythm to it, much like uh, a jazz piece, you know, or a blues piece, a rhythm that you don't encounter in other literature. It's been 10 years since August Wilson passed on. In my opinion, uh, and in the opinion of most of us here at the Goodman Theater, is that his work definitely should be taught in schools. So we all thought that it might be a good idea to remind Chicagoans what August Wilson meant to the city of Chicago. And this is an opportunity for individuals to catch up with the plays that they've missed, because there will be readings of all of the other nine plays outside of Two Trains Running. If you don't know where you have been, then how in the hell do you know where you're going? And that's what this cycle represents. It represents where we have been as a people and hopefully where we're headed. You know, like when we were kids, they used to call us in from playing outside and make us read the dictionary. And that's the way they need to do it August, you know, call the kids in from outside and make them read August Wilson.